Hola a todos y bienvenidos una vez más al juego que nos enseña a ser unos galanes con el sexo opuesto o terminar siendo denunciados a la policía por degenerados. Super Seducer tu gente, regresa en gloria y majestad. La verdad es que nunca se fue, simplemente no, 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 pudo, no sabía cómo desbloquear los dos niveles que quedaban. Desbloqueé el penúltimo, así que sin más preámbulos, vamos entonces al capítulo 10, aplicaciones de citas. Lleva tus citas de Tinder al siguiente nivel y programa una cita con una rubia hermosa. Objetivo, tener citas. You can never touch this, baby. You can never touch this. I'm the king. I'm the king, baby. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Stephanie, how are the things with your husband? My husband? He's amazing, you know. I'm in so in love with him. Yeah, he's sick. You're so lucky. Thank you. I want to have someone to rely on to and to oh, hang in the don't evening. Don't worry, you're beautiful, so I'm sure you'll find someone. I'm yeah. not so beautiful as you think. Oh, you're not. And I don't have big boobs like Diana. Oh, don't say that. You're beautiful. Thank okay. you, darling. You're welcome. Oh, what's up, girls? How's it going? Uh, listen, I just saw you from over there and you just look amazing. I'd stay and chat, but I've got a business meeting, so why don't you give me your number and I'll message you. There you go. Eh, nuestro amigo el degenerado, eh, va y va a pedir el número. Pero gente, tienen que ser como nuestro amigo el degenerado. Vayan nomás con toda la confianza y pidan el número. Lo peor que le pueden decir es que no. O que los denuncien a la policía. ¿Girar? ¿Por qué girar? Hey. Ah. Um, listen. Uh, while I'm here, can you give me your number as well? Hey, give the phone to her. Give it. Ay, no. Ay. Ah, y se le robó el celular, le robó la... Ahí está bien. Oh, shit, gente. Qué, qué genial es tener al gente generado de regreso al canal. Al cochinote. Es un poco greedy. Sí, estás eligiendo cantidad sobre cantidad. Ellos eran bastante cantidad también, para ser honesto, los dos. ¿Y cómo todas esas relaciones de largo plazo se han hecho? Ah. Got wet. Got wet. <risa> eh, <risa> gente, lo mejor la cara. Una vez más, a la cara y nos saltamos el resto porque ya lo vimos. A la cara, a la cara, miren. <risa> oh. <Hey. risa> <Hey. risa> la última, la última, que la cara. <risa> oh. <Hey. risa> ya, ya. <risa> Muy bien, eh, mantener. Sí. Be cool, boy, be cool, my boy. Right, see ya. Have a good day. Bye. That's the right move in this case because, yeah, shouldn't be greedy. And you can put quality over quantity. Yeah. Pero gente, no hay que ser codicios. O en su justa medida. Sí, even this guy went straight to Diana. Oh no, don't see that. You know. I could find you a nice guy on Tinder, you know. I don't think I can find really nice guy on Tinder. My goodness, trust me, I got this. Can I have your phone? Quick, can I have your phone? Okay. Yeah, trust me. Okay, so you know what? First of all, I have to get your profile set up. Okay. Yeah, so let's, um, let's see how this goes. All right. 
Oh yeah, that's it. Trust me, I got this. <laughs> right, well that's enough Bloodborne for today. What next? It's time to get some girls. Now, what pictures shall I use? Oh, you look so beautiful here. Take a look. Yeah, I like it too. Yeah. What do you think about it? Yeah, this is great. Yeah, she looks so beautiful. I think we'll have to put this picture. What do you think? Okay. And another one. Oh, wow. This one. Mm. You like sexy legs, girl. Yeah. It's so nice. Yeah, I think this one would do, would it? Okay. What do you think? We can take a look at this other one. I think this one. This one? Yeah. Um... No? No, I think you look too sexy here. You know, because if I put this on there, they would think you just want to get laid. No. I don't think so. Well, I think so. I'm the pro here, so yeah. <laughs> She's a prophet. Next, uh... Oh, wow, this is nice! Beautiful! What do you think? Cool, yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. And you say you don't... Oh, goodness. This is pretty. Girl. I'll put this on Tinder and let's see what happens. Ok, agradezco que nuestra amiga no tuviese foto, no sé, eh, haciendo caca o sacándole una foto a la caca. No sé por qué alguien haría eso, pero la amiga le está revisando el teléfono y nunca sabe cuándo le está revisando el teléfono que pueden encontrar ahí. Ok, tenemos a nuestro amigo que yo pensé que estaba jugando Dark Souls, pero él dijo que era Bloodborne. Muy bien, muchas fotos tuyas con tu familia, perros y haciendo obras de caridad. Poner una foto tuya sin la parte de arriba, muchas fotos con tus amigos bebiendo, un montón de fotos profesionales y retratos fuertemente photoshopeados, una mezcla de actividades que te apasionan y que te permiten iniciar una buena conversación, una foto tuya con un gato. ¿Y ¿Dónde está la foto demostrando el ano o haciendo alguna cochina? Vamos con fuertemente photoshopeada, con lo más lolero. Yeah, my sexy photo shoot pictures. Look at me there. Look at me. And just because you got very nice pictures, you've you've got some nice pictures, right? But oh, if you, yeah, thank I you. noticed. So if you were making a profile, you could just use them. But then we wouldn't really get to know the real you, right? Versus if you put some sociable pictures, some Careful. hobbies. Pictures with these guys. Yeah, I think you need to know what you are like as a rounded person, not just pretty pictures. You're not very round. I mean, you're, you're very thin. You know what I mean. No, okay. Por supuesto, respuesta que cada pongo una foto con el gato. Ah, picture with my cat. Girls are gonna love it. Excellent, the correct choice. And I think we looked up some studies and we found that women are more likely to uh, choose a guy that has some pictures with... Actually, dogs were better than cats. Okay, but so cats or good. dogs? Mm -hmm. Either's good, just, I guess, not, I don't know, tons of massive dogs or 50 cats. But... Yeah, that might not be the best first impression. Pero gente papuye, los quiero tomando nota. Los quiero aquí, todos unos galanes los papuyos del canal. write for my bio? It's quite important, right? I need to stand out. Hacer una lista de todos pasatiempos e intereses. ¿Ya? Ser franco, escucha, estoy aquí para acostarme con alguien sin pagar. <risa> Pero mirar sobre tu alergia a los gatos, ya que tienes fotos de gatos. Saltar la sección biográfica, nadie las lee y te verás misterioso. Uh, no, no. Ah, esta es como la peor de todas, vamos. Y obviamente siempre intentamos elegir la peor de todas al principio. What to write? Ah, I know what the bitch is like. You dirty little slag. Just come and suck me off. You're gonna love it. What else? <laughs> ¿Qué más? Yeah, get on your knees, whore. <laughs> I wouldn't work off some of it. No, <laughs> el really magnifico ganador es como... Like oh, so que aquí van a llegar todas, aquí vienen todas. One in a hundred? Mm -mm. One in that thousand? That looks lovely. Ah, oh, thanks. Eh, la del gato que me imagino que es como la correcta algo What's gracioso right? hmm. <laughs> I know oh I got the thing cat allergy lol send that's gonna work 
So it's good to put something in your bio, and and if it can make her laugh, perfect, right? Yeah, if you can make her laugh instantly on the bio before you even get to meet her, that's that's great. And Sam is a dating coach in London. Uh, He runs a company called Fluid Social. And this is his actual bio where he makes the joke about uh, allergy to cats, but then has the cat pictures. (laughs) Should I, should I, yes, no, it costs money. Maybe I should, but I like money. But I like girls. ¿Pagar por Tinder Plus? Sí, especialmente si viajas. Sí, porque puedes ocultar tu edad. No, ahorra dinero. Sí, gracias a los deslizamientos ilimitados. Sí, porque la gente de Tinder Plus tiene prioridad cuando se trata de coincidencias. No, te hace parecer más desesperado. Creo que es la última. No hay ninguna así como totalmente incorrecta, a mi parecer. ¿No? That doesn't make you look more desperate. It could uh, give you more opportunities. Yeah, it could make the most of the situation. Ok, especialmente... Eh, porque la gente tiene plata, tiene prioridad con hacerte coincidencias. Great, good job. Ok, esto ya suena como una especie de publicidad metida en un juego. Maybe I should just choose everyone so I get more matches. Deslizar a la derecha casi todas las chicas. Ser más selectivo. Me imagino que esta es incorrecta, pero vamos inmediatamente con la correcta porque no, la otra opción tampoco no, es que sea tan gracioso. No. Creo yo. No. No. Wow. Wow, she's really hot. No. No. She's cute, but no. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no. No. This is an interesting one because um, Tinder actually want it to be a good experience for the women. So they don't like guys that just match with everyone because then a lot of those uh, matches won't turn into conversations, won't turn into dates. So they reward guys that are more selective. So yeah, um, pay attention to the algorithm and try not to just choose everyone. <laughs> este episodio no es auspiciado por Tinder. Oh, she looks She doesn't show her body though, so I don't know if it's going to be good. Um, she looks all right. Pero es el Jota que está jugando sure. Fall Guys. Let me check her bio. Oh, hi, mom. Hmm. Deslizar a la derecha, elegir la deslizar a la izquierda. Elige la, da lo mismo que tenga ropa, o sea, que no se le vea que tiene para abajo. Yeah. Obviously the wrong one, she won't look as good in person. <laughs> What the fuck? Okay, eh... Una pequeña reflexión hasta el momento. He notado que este, episo- este es un episodio bonus. Se, de- se desbloquea al haber completado todos los anteriores con el mejor resultado posible. No sé ustedes, pero al momento yo lo encuentro relativamente mucho más bajo comparado al otro, tanto como en, en historia como en presupuesto. A lo mejor era un, una, algo de prueba, derechamente es publicidad de Tinder, eh, no lo sé. A lo mejor a usted le parece entretenido, pero bueno, deslizar a la izquierda. Mm, no. Cool, nice one. In most cases, people are going to choose their very best pictures. So if someone's just, you know, showing their pretty face, but you can't see even a hint of their body, uh, yeah, it probably means that they don't have a great body. If this is of big importance to you, it wouldn't be to me. Or well, what if it was like the world's fattest man? He might be very, very funny. There are f- funny men that aren't the world's fattest, though. True. <laughs> So I would have to go and meet them to find out if they were the funniest man ever. I could be missing my chances. Okay, well, that's very nice. So sweet. Your <laughs> Charlotte is muy dulce. She looks good in this picture, but bad in this one. Hmm, what shall I do? Oh, in this picture, she looks minging again. <laughs> uh, la peor foto probablemente sea la más verdadera. Las fotos malas podrían ser solamente un mal ángulo para ella. ¿Sí? 
Shall I? Shall I? Shall I? Shall I? Pues estoy equivocada. No, that's not sí. good because yeah, in my experience, people generally put their best photos, mm -hmm. especially nowadays. They have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pictures of yeah, themselves. Yeah, they do. That's true. So if they still have some bad ones, it's kind of yeah. Yeah. Sí, claro, nuestro amigo de generado, el cochino, te tiene razón. Por lo general, mucha gente pone las mejores fotos que encuentran en internet. Should I? Nah, better not risk. Yeah, in most cases, people will choose their very best pictures. So even if a few of those ones look really bad and, you know, a couple are good, you should probably trust the worst ones because, like I said, yeah, they choose the ones that make them look best. Yeah, that makes sense. Yes, got a match. Fuck. She's really hot. Oh, we matched. No shit. Of course, any guy you choose is gonna match with you. Oh well, let's see what he messages. Hopefully he's not some other dumbass on the Tinder because we have lots of weathers there. Like everywhere else. Remember that Dave, guy who I met in a bar? Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. He seemed nice, but then he started to send me his dick pics. Ooh. Yeah, I imagine. And it wasn't <laughs> even that big. <laughs> it was so little, yeah. <laughs> And he even had the guts to send it. Crazy. Crazy, really. She's studying tech business. Hmm, that's strange. She looks like a model. What shall I write? Ok, gente, aquí puede comenzar lo interesante. ¿Qué crees que es mejor en un centro de esquí los Alpes o una escapada de una isla? La respuesta puede decir mucho acerca de una persona. Uh, qué misterioso. Hola, Tania. Negocio de tecnología. Interesante. ¿Eres más fan de Jeff Bezos o de Zuckerberg? Envíale un montón de emojis. Hola, ¿cómo ha ido el día? Ok, las últimas dos, la C y la D, por supuesto, son las peores, porque es como que no te dicen nada, es como puro un monito. Y como es la, la incorrecta, vamos a ponerle enviar un montón de emojis. What to say? Chicks like emojis, I'll send a bunch. <risa> un galán el tipo. Great. He must be 13 years old. Because a guy who sends this many emojis cannot satisfy a woman in the bedroom. <laughs> Ouch. Pero gente papuya, cuidado con mandar emojis como idiotas. Ah, fuck. So I always say that sending emojis, you know, it's not very, not very cool for a guy unless he's a teenager or something. What do mm -hmm. you think? Um, I'm a big emoji fan, but I can see where you're coming from. What's your favorite one? The pineapple. The pineapple? When do you use that? Whenever. There's always an occasion. What about the grape emoji? Yep. All the fruit emojis are great. Como que ahí se le acabó el guión, así es como que ya este es el episodio bonus, eh, es con lo que nos alcanza el presupuesto. ¿Cuál es tu emoji favorito? La piña. Y la uva también. ¿Sí? <risa> Hasta cuando se le está acabando el presupuesto al degenerado, el cochinote, no se hace reír. Este también va a estar mala, ¿por qué? Porque es como que, hola, que es como me común y corriente. O bien podría ser de las que son malas, pero igual no dejan progresar. Pero ya que obviamente la A y la B dan un paso a lo que podría ser una conversación más interesante. Y esto es como que, hola, ¿cómo ha ido el día? Bien. Y el tuyo, bien. Bueno, chao. That'll do. Keep it simple. Why not? Oh, God. So boring. Maybe we ignore it. No, let's answer. So at least he knows how he messed up. Oh yeah, let's help these losers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Oh fuck, she's taking the piss. I'll call her out on it. I guess you were being ironic. It's just me parece que está mala por, por lo mismo lo que luego conversamos el cochinote y Charlotte concuerdan con nosotros y el perrito también. Ah, okay, vamos por la segunda más que nada porque como tiene relación con la tecnología que está estudiando ella, a ver qué nos dice. What shall I send? Ah, yeah, got just the right thing. Tengo justo lo, la cosa exacta ya que no, no me quise introducir los subtítulos. Bezos, Zuckerberg. Oh, cool. Good start. Bien, buen comienzo, no, dijo, dijo la amiga. Le dio su perfil. Actualmente le dio su perfil. Está hablando sobre esos tipos de los cuales tú siempre hablas, el tipo de Google y Tesla. Amazon, and Facebook, Amazon y Facebook, Stephanie. Stephanie. Heard of them? ¿Nunca has oído de ellos? Te enviaré algunas biografías para que leas. No necesitas preguntarle, un, hacerle una pregunta o algo, o no. We can't make him no podemos hacer get you so easily, you know. que te, 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 te agarre tan fácil. Okay. Esfuerce por ello. Not so bad. Ok, no está tan mal. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, that's it. I got him. Bam, she liked it. Man, cool, así que solamente sure. leíste mi perfil, estoy impresionada. Cool, nice one. This is good because, uh, firstly, it's interesting and kind of demands a response. And secondly, it's noticing something in her profile, not just complimenting on her looks or saying, hey, what's up? En tercer lugar, se te está quedando presupuesto de generado, ni siquiera traduciste esa parte de los subtítulos. Mm, yeah, I can read, I can talk, all kinds of crazy tricks. And sent. Amazing tricks. Well, I hope it's not the mangina thing again. <laughs> el mangina, gente, que el mejor truco de todos los tiempos, el mangina. Anyway, it oh, might yeah. not even be his real picture. Oh. I heard about a guy who uses someone else's pictures, mm -hmm. and you don't even know until you meet him. Oh, don't worry, my darling. El cassé, what the fuck? I'm gonna make sure you don't meet anyone <laughs> without my seal of approval. <laughs> Oh, she answered. Hmm. Hmm. My best trick. What is my best trick, actually? Voy a chuparme mi propio pollo. Estábamos esperando este tipo de respuestas. Puedo pararme de cabeza. No voy a revelar eso inmediatamente. Primero dime tres cosas interesantes sobre ti misma. Ok, podría ser entre la B y la C. La C para parecer gracioso. Pero la B podríamos conocer un poco más algo de ella. Pero por supuesto que lo primero que vamos a elegir es la letra A. What to write? I know, my dick. This is going to impress the shit out of her. Y mandale el meme del tipo que tiene el, su, su faro en la boca. Oh, well, okay, ladies. We've got another psycho. Oh, that's actually impressive if it's true. <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Yeah, crazy. Yeah, I find that <laughs> disgusting and I'd be quick to delete uh, all uh, numbers relating careful, to you, including <laughs> Tinder itself. Me dirigí una respuesta, quería que la otra persona borre Tinder. <laughs> Vamos con esta, a ver si le podemos sacar alguna información sobre ella misma. Suena feo, te voy a sacar información. Si podemos conocer algo más de ella, ¿vieron? A ver, ¿vieron gente? Pero hay gente, si uno, uno se maneja aquí en este, en este tipo de cosas, uno, uno no le saca información, sino que conoce más a la otra persona. ¿Se dan cuenta? Ah, ah. En una aparece un degenerado a punto de ser funado y cancelado, y en la otra aparece un papullo. What shall I write? Ooh, I've got something clever. And I'm so smart. I'm not going to reveal it immediately. Aren't I intelligent? Ooh. What did he write? He's asking for some interesting things about you, Tanya. Mm. At least that's quite different. He's bold. I'll say that for him. But let's not answer him for now. I think. Yeah. 
Nice one, good choice, and that's cool because just like in many dating situations, being just a little bit challenging sets you apart and is good. <laughs> oh, thank you You're very welcome. much. welcome. Right. Mm. So? Yeah, I think he's waiting long enough. Let's message him. Are you going to tell him the three interesting things? Um, nah. I'm not ready to jump through his lips so easily. Mm. Yeah. He's got to wait. Oh, yeah. Aquí está peligrosa la cosa, porque le decimos directamente, mira, estamos jugando PlayStation. Mientras nos hacemos paja furiosa. Yo dije, mmm, le hacemos honesto, decimos que estamos jugando PlayStation, va a pensar, oh, en los juegos, jejeje. Je, je. O oh, no, pero, pero lo de las la pajas furiosas ya me obviamente me dice, esta es la elección correcta. He estado ocupado, estoy conduciendo, así que tuviste un tiempo para pensarlo. Estoy deseando escuchar esas tres cosas interesantes sobre ti. Ok, la vez la correcta para mí. Un día muy ocupado, estoy conduciendo las carreteras, son una locura. ¿Qué hay de ti? Vamos con la A, que es la incorrecta. This will get hot and bothered. <risa> What the fuck? Yeah. Well, there is honesty and then there is honesty. What do you mean? He's playing PlayStation and one Kim. I wonder if he's playing God of War. But Ooh. anyway, block him, please. Well, I like the video game. Mentioned God of War. That's kind of my day uh, usually, to be honest. But really? Uh, <laughs> yeah, not furious wanking though. But oh, I'm so so lovely to hear that. Yeah, but PlayStation all day is okay, isn't it? I uh, know. Still no. Just no? get some other hobbies. What if you just got um, God of War and you just. It's great. I don't think it makes any difference. You need to have more to talk about. You played it, God of War? No. No, I haven't. Oh, I feel sorry for you. Get over it. ¿Qué tiene de malo la paja furiosa? Como decía nuestro amigo el cochinote. <risa> Oye, vamos con la B. Creo que la C podría ser de las que eh, no son las mejores, pero no dejan pasar igual. Pero yo creo que la definitiva es la B. What have I been up to? I can't just say I've been playing PlayStation. Claro, Try regale lo de la paja furiosa. <laughs> and I need to ask her about those three things again. Okay, he's driving. Hmm. I wonder what car he has. Don't be so materialistic. Listen, babe, you're a full package. If you want a guy who is smart and kind and rich, you can have him. Plus, You can borrow his car and drive me around. I wouldn't Aww. mind. My car is a Ross package, by the way, so it would go a long way. Hopefully it's a Tesla. We need to protect our environment. So I've been telling you all, you should just ride bikes and stop eating meat. Uh, okay, close. by the way, he's on about the three interesting things again. Do we tell him? Sure, sure. We can tell him. We can. I'll tell him. Boy. I so our resident Tinder expert said that this is the right choice. Uh, not pushing and being super, super annoyingly persistent, but one more time is good to, you know, try and get those three interesting things and not let it go. Maybe have our time to think about it. Yeah. Okay, babe, what are those three interesting things going to be? I'm knowledgeable, I'm ambitious, and I'm demanding. Are you trying to pull him off totally or what? Okay, I guess this is up to me too, as usual. I got this. Cool, she replied. She says she's creative, loyal, and she loves to laugh. 
What shall I reply? ¿Y dónde quedó la paja furiosa? Bueno, ser leal es bueno, los perros son buenos, las mujeres son como los perros igual perfecto. Me gusta la gente que es creativa, así que supongo que tú también eres espontánea. Me gusta una chica que es creativa con sus técnicas de mamá. Eso la sé, por supuesto. What to do? I know. I like girls who are creative with their blowjob techniques. She's gonna love this one. <risa> Inmediatamente cuando elegimos una opción incorrecta es por una cara de degenerado los protagonistas. <risa> ¿Qué pensaría si recibes ese mensaje? Ya que no hay I mean, I would say I don't particularly you know like you. Diría que particularmente no me gusta. Not you, the, the person. No tú, la persona que me gusta. Pero te gusta, ¿cierto? Some of the time. <risa> A veces digo. <risa> Los subtítulos degenerados, cochinote. Eh, vamos con... Vamos con la B porque... Porque la A, por mucho que esté comparando a las mujeres con un perro, lo cual es... <ríe> es a todas luces de respuesta incorrecta. Tal vez el juego me la pase por correcta. No sé qué esperar del, del juego del, del cochinote. Así que me voy por la B. Always good to work in the spontaneity stuff. She'll love it. What did he answer? What? Nice one. Uh, we see this a few times in the game. Uh, generally, bringing up spontaneity is never a bad thing because most people would agree that they're interested in spontaneous and have uh, various positive characteristics. Ok, pero la cara del personaje no indicó como... ¡Wow! La cosa espontánea no es siempre buena. ¿Sabes? Una vez conocí a un hombre que me preguntó si era espontánea. Y cuando dije sí, intentó abrazarme en la calle, en el día. ¿Qué hiciste? Pero esto tiene que ser espontáneo, eso no es de respetar el espacio de las personas. Él era muy cool, pero... ¿Tienes el punto? No, en realidad. Ok... Let's at least make sure he doesn't want dirty pics. Not really. Ah, oh, shit. No dirty pictures. Actually, that means she's a good girl. Espera, ¿significa entonces que la respuesta correcta era la de los perros? O sea, no sé qué opinan ustedes, gente, pero para mí esa respuesta era comparar a la mujer con un perro. A lo mejor en otros países donde se hizo el juego eso es algo bueno, pero aquí suena feo. Suena horrible, al menos aquí en Chile. Es como, ah, me gustan los perros porque son como las mujeres. ¿Qué? ¿What? <risa> Dejen su opinión ahí si es que tienen una opinión al respecto. No iba a pedirte que me mandaras una foto obscena, iba a pedirte que me mandaras una linda foto con una sonrisa. Envíalo aquí por iMessage. ¿No eres una de esas chicas frígidas que no tienen sexo hasta la cita 16? <risa> Honestamente me gusta la chica que decía que fue básicamente. Vamos con la respuesta incorrecta. What to write? Quiero escribir. Ya que subtítulos se fueron. Straight with this horse, she's gonna like it. Yes, just make things clear. I need to fuck straight away. I need to fuck straight away. Creo que eso se entiende bastante. Damn. Damn. I thought this guy was okay. Pensaba que este chico estaba bien. He's not a dodgy guy. Well, I guess it's better to find out sooner rather than later. Es mejor eh, saberlo pronto I que luego. Have sex on date four, I think. Normalmente te digo sexo en la cita 4, okay. beso en la 1 y el resto no lo escucha. Okay. Mm. Totally wrong, <laughs> very inappropriate. You took the words right out of my mouth. Es Charlotte mira para el lado como se acabó el guión. <ríe> Vamos con esta que es la respuesta correcta. Let's try and get this off Tinder onto iMessage. Okay, he wants a selfie. No biggie. We already have about 200 photos to choose from. <laughs> Y quiere irse a iMessage. 
that's quite smart you already have tons of people messaging you here so cool so this is good obviously asking for dirty pictures is a big no-no um it's yeah it's just going to be annoying sending your own dirty pictures also a no-no absolutely not and getting it off um, of tinder and onto imessage our tinder expert says it's very very good because she's likely to have tons of guys messaging her in tinder so your messages could just be buried amongst like 30 other guys and if you move it to imessage or whatever other messaging application is common in your country then that's a much better way to carry on things Y si tengo Android, no tengo iMessage. Wow, thank you, mama. That looks lovely. Decir que tu madre ha hecho comida para... Pero que no piense que hay algo sexual con ella. Déjala colgar mientras comes. Ahorita foto, lo siento. Tengo una reunión de negocio. Volveré pronto. <risa> la relación con la mamá. I better write to her that my mom made me dinner. But make sure she doesn't get the wrong idea. It's not one of those weird pornos. Y además de darle a entender que la mamá lo alimenta. Can you imagine? <laughs> well, he has more chance with his mom than with you, Tanya. <laughs> Uh, probably didn't need to clarify that, yeah, about the old uh, sex with mum thing. Yeah, and this is supposed to be a joke. It really, really wasn't very funny. Eh, vamos con la C, porque imagino que dejarla colgada o igual podría ser buena, porque es como dejar a la expectativa, es como que mira, estoy hablando contigo, pero tengo otras cosas que hacer, de ahí veré tu mensaje, gente. Así es, gente, porque entre ustedes y yo, la generación de cristal hace todas las cosas mal. Uh, vamos con la bonita foto, reunión de negocio. Oh, food or Tinder. Food, definitely food. Just answer her quickly though, and Yes, yummy. Yes, yummy. He has a business meeting. I wonder what his job is. Maybe he's an architect. I love architects. Mm. And bankers are good too. Trabaja haciéndose pajas furiosas. So this is a difficult one, you know. I think that if you're naturally going to have a little break and you're doing something, you could maybe leave the phone and not answer. And that keeps her thinking about you in the interim. Pero you decíamos, kind of say, okay, I'm going to my business meeting or to eat my lunch, mm -hmm. uh, and I'll message you in an hour. It loses yeah. something. Es lo que hablamos. Es lo que hablamos. Es que hablamos. Es un poco de suspensa la cosa. In a, is an hour in advance. It's not that romantic. Whereas if you just per chance are eating lunch, then you finish, and then yep. you text her. It's much more natural. Good to fit this stuff into your natural life, not mm -hmm. to make it something Contrived. you're always doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Y es lo que hablamos de que, por ejemplo, mucha gente joven, muy joven de hoy en día, la generación que uno puede decirle de cristal, entre comillas, es como que no tienes que hablar inmediatamente, sino no, se pierde esa cosa. He must be psychic. Maybe we should delay some pictures from today. 17 is a bit too much. Anyway, I'll just send this. Now we'll ask her whether she's ready to hear my rule. ¿Qué, qué regla? Oh, he asked if we want to hear his rule. Do we go? Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. And yes, she agrees. A ver, cuando vuelva a casa del trabajo, quiero que te pongas de rodilla mientras te golpeo. <risa> Soy anticuado, así que si tenemos una cita, voy a coger tu abrigo, abriré la puerta, separaré tu silla y obviamente insisto en pagar. 
Si tenemos una cita, entonces no tenemos que revisar nuestros teléfonos para que podamos conocernos. La C es la correcta, pero por supuesto la mejor es la A. La mejor en términos de comedia, no vayan a pensar que soy un degenerado y me vayan a funar. Uh, uh, me, me, me funaron otra vez. What to write? Oh, I got it. Great line. Just wait for it. I will beat you with my cock, dirty little shit. <laughs> dirty little shit, le dijo. Oh, God. He must watch too much porn. <laughs> not understand <laughs> women at all. Debe ver demasiado porn. How could he ever expect that to work? <laughs> Esa es su regla. <laughs> Goodness. Crazy. Crazy. <laughs> El tipo quedó feliz así como la hice. Charlotte, you like that message? No, I hate it. It's, it's vile. It's actually awful, yeah. <risa> ok, vamos con la C. Podría ser la B también porque... Eh, hay muchas personas que igual le gustan esas cosas. El abrir la puerta, entre comillas, la caballerosidad. Pero no sean tan caballeros. Hay que tener un, 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 una distinción entre la caballerosidad y entre ser el tipo arrastrado. Uh, Así que vamos con la C. Ok, she's ready to hear it. Here we go. Oh, that's pretty cool. I should have that rule, you girls. <laughs> She agrees. Cool. Yeah, great. Well done. Um, real pet peeve of mine. If you both have your phones out at the dinner table, even if you've been dating for 10 years, this is an absolute no-no. Um, take every second you can to get to know one another. Beautiful message. Sí, es horrible cuando uno ve una persona hace mucho tiempo, se junta con ella y pisa el celular ahí. Hola, ¿qué tal el celular? ¿Qué tal? Ah, ah. God, she's sexy. I need to make this more sexual. Oh my god, look at that ass. Oh, what I'd do to that. ¿Se, ¿Se está tocando? Bajó la manita de manera misteriosa. Eh, no me gusta cuando la gente dice inapropiada en Tinder, pero tienes un cuerpo sexy. Vas mucho al gimnasio, eres de esas personas a las que odian las chicas que comen hamburguesas y siguen pare pareciendo modelo de traje de baño. Esa es una buena foto, ¿sabes? Cuando los tipos están masturbando. Esa es la incorrecta pero cómica. <risa> Look how sexy she is. Oh my god. I know what to say. That's a good picture. And she obviously like guys when they're wanking over it, dirty slag. He's probably right, <risa> to be honest. Ooh, don't say that. Yuck. I don't mind if guys touch themselves while they look at my pics. I take it as a compliment. Porque lo más gracioso es que el personaje actúa muy normal, como y corriente, hasta que elegimos la elección degenerada y como que se transforma completamente en su cara, su pensamiento todo se pone degenerado. No me gusta cuando la gente se apropia en Tinder, pero tienes un cuerpo sexy. Ok, creo que eso es un buen cumplido, o al menos mucho mejor que el de odiar a la gente que come hamburguesas. I don't want to be rude, but she is so damn sexy. I guess I need to let her know right now. Here we go. Hmm. He was doing well, but don't know about this. You do have a sexy body, though. Creo que ella se sintió bien. No lo sé, la amiga no le gustó mucho, pero... Es un compliment directo físico. Usualmente un poco arriesgado. En este caso, no creo que sea tan malo. No es un killer. 
-hmm. but it does speak volumes about him. Sí, creo que el de la hamburguesa era mejor porque también se camuflaba con algo de humor. ¿Por qué quedó tan mal? How is he doing so far? Pretty well, right? Yeah, he is. We still don't know him that well yet. I know what to ask you. Okay. Oh God, that's a tough one. What are my best traits? Oh, that's pretty good. You're learning. <laughs> Nice. Good job. Escucha, estoy feliz de responderte esto. Te llamo cinco minutos. Eso te da tiempo para preparar tu mejor voz para el teléfono. Uh, uh, podría ser. Puedo llamarte y ella responde. Mm, de acuerdo. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué ustedes las, <risa> las bitches creen que tienen derecho a preguntar? <risa> Esta es la incorrecta, pero la cómica. La corte creo que es la primera. Why is this stupid bitch asking me? Get the fuck out of here. Mira cómo se molesta. Are you ready to meet me or not? If not, go fuck yourself. <risa> como un psicópata, así como. <risa> Some men are so rude. He must have big problems in his life to be such a prick. Take a look. Don't show me what he wrote. That message to other guys. So is that a good, you know? Get straight to the point kind of message. Get to the point. Yeah. <laughs> I think you've made your point loud and clear and that's definitely a... <laughs> for me. No, oh, agreed. Vamos con la... Porque la B podría ser típica que es incorrecta pero igual te dejan pasar y esta es como más, más coqueta. What to say? Hmm... Need to be decisive here. I'll tell her I want to call her and add a joke. That's the one. Great. Oh, he's gonna call. What shall I say to him? Leave it to me. I'll speak to him. That will surprise him. Okay, cool. Eh, seguimos así, la amiga nice se, se yes, va a querer hablar con el tipo. Moving it to the phone is great because, you know, getting to know someone by text, it can take a long time and not really tell you too much. Yeah, and I think it's a really que good middle ground before you actually meet them to work out if there's any chemistry or a little bit of a spark there. Because I don't really ah, feel you get to know someone over text. Oh, he's calling. Hello, hi Sam. Hi, Tanya. Oh, no, Sam. This is Stephanie. I'm Tanya's friend. You need to speak to me first. Um, why? She doesn't need any joke, guys. So I'll speak to you first. And if I like you, then you can meet her for a date. Okay? So I guess was this you texting me earlier as well? We both were, but everything was true. Okay, well, this is pretty weird, but what the hell? Let's do it. Cool. So, Sam, tell me about those three best traits. Soy amable, muy decidido y divertido. Pero rubio, ojos azules, polla grande y dura. Esa es la que vamos a elegir. Soy amable, muy decidido, ambicioso. ¿Y por qué no me cuentas la tercera ya que me conoces un poco? Uh, esa yo creo que es la buena. Blonde hair, blue eyes, big, hard dick. What? <laughs> you're lucky you're on the phone and not with me. I will chop off your dick and the hair with it. The hair on my dick? I shaved it already. <laughs> What? Hello? 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 This guy is crazy. Good. <laughs> <Como psicopata>, <laughs> Como que bueno que el cortamos acá al tipo. I got black long hair and uh, green eyes and a, and that's where you stop. And smash dick so nothing. <laughs> smash dick. Vamos con esta porque también tiene un poco de coquetón, eh. I'm decisive and very ambitious 
and why don't you tell me the third one since you know me a little bit now? Oh, cool. I guess you are quite bold. That's good. True, true. I am bold. Cool, nice choice. A little bit of a challenge, not jumping through her hoops. Yeah, and it also gives her a chance to compliment him and him to find out whether she's even interested in him. Mm -hmm. Are you a serious guy or are you just looking for sex? Escucha, ¿por qué no deja con él antes de que decidas casarnos? En serio, estoy buscando sexo. Claro, quiero casarme inmediatamente. ¿Cuándo reservamos la iglesia? Tenemos que encontrarnos primero porque la vida no funciona así. Obviamente la encuentro atractiva. Supongo que... Vamos con esta porque es como cómica. Sure, I'm ready to get married immediately. Where should we book the church? Um, I was serious, actually. Why can't you just answer the question? Well, look, to be honest, I'm a young guy. I do see a lot of women. But if I'm in a relationship, I am faithful. Okay, Sam. Well, really? This is quite funny and sí, potentially gracioso. okay, not sí, that bad. Creo. Eso, sigue dando explicaciones a la amiga. ¿Por qué no arreglas una cita para nosotros? Estoy libre los martes y jueves. ¿Cuál sería el mejor para Tania? Parece que a ti también te gusta. Esto podemos fuir todos. <risa> Well, I think you like me too. Are you fit? Tanya's fit. I think we should all just bang. All right. Um, send your address. We'll come right now. It's 22 Canterbury Street, but come round the back because mum's going to be in. Yeah, I'll send my brothers right away. Dick. Oh, shit. <laughs> Mama. Mama. <laughs> Mom. Mom. For your under su mama. So the old uh, threesome play, what do you think of that? I mean, there's a reason why it didn't work. Well, since you're the matchmaker, Stephanie, why don't you arrange a date for Tanya and I? I'm free Tuesday and Thursday. So this is cool because a lot of guys make the mistake of saying, when are you free? And, uh, or are you free tomorrow? She's like, no, what about the next day? And I insinuate also, I suppose, that they are free all the time. There's nothing to do. Yeah. They're just at home playing uh, PlayStation or playing games on Steam and they can meet anytime, mm. which is not attractive. No, so it's always good to give her, give her an option, is yeah. it, would you say? Yeah, and I'd say also that if you're not busy, or you don't have some things to do, that's wrong as well. You need to get out and get some things that you're doing so that you have that attractive uh, social life. And you have something to talk about when you're actually on the date. Okay, I'll ask her. We're holding. When I think... Thursday. Thursday's okay, yeah. So what do you suggest? She won't meet you for drinks. I know what you Tinder guys usually try. No soy el tipo común de Tinder. Trato de hacer sexo. Ser el Kasek. No tengo el sonido de Kasek diciendo sexo anal aquí en este computador. En las primeras citas está en el PC secundario. Es una pena. Estaba pensando que podríamos ir a Héroes. Es increíble el bar de cócteles nuevos. La verdad es lástima que me llamaras el tipo de Tinder. A ver, solo for the lulz, pero no creo que suene. No, sonó en el PC de al lado, no sonó en, el, en la grabación. Bueno, eh, vamos con la primera, en honor a casi. You know, I'm not your average Tinder guy. In fact, I go for anal on the first date. ¡Sí, te lo vamos atrás! ¿Qué dijo? ¿Qué dijo? ¿Qué dijo? Mom, it's a private call. So, Mom, it wasn't what you think. Mama, Mama, Mom, <laughs> Mom, sorry, Mom, Mom. 
Но въпреки uh, това, мали са ръкпоите? Ох, я. That question in itself is inappropriate, so you're not going to get an answer. It's a second at least. Aquí no sé, estoy dudando cuál puede ser la correcta. Esta porque tenemos un plan decidido, mira, quiero ir allá en lugar de decir dónde quieres ir, ay, no sé. Well, that's a real shame, because I was going to take her to an amazing new cocktail bar called Heroes. I'm not sure if that's what all Tinder guys do, but I think we both know this is different. Well, that sounds okay, actually. Do you like cocktails? I really do. Okay. Okay. So apparently, talking to girls, we found out that uh, most guys who are looking for something casual offer evening drinks. Right. So that's why you know she kind of preempted that. But if you have something a little bit special, a little bit interesting, you know, uh, an award-winning cocktail bar or some kind of themed place that's really cool, then uh, obviously that's more of an attractive proposition than just a local bar. I suppose it also looks like you've again thought about it. Mm -hmm. So it's not just you know the local bar that you take all your Tinder dates to. Why don't you go for dinner? Remember, Tanya is not one of those girls who doesn't like to eat. De ninguna manera te voy a infligir mis terribles modales en la primera mesa, en la mesa de la primera cita. Muy bien, dime qué restaurante. ¿Sabes qué? Me encanta salir a cenar, pero es un poco demasiado formal, así que eso es para la segunda cita. Mmm, aquí no sé si es la primera o la última. No, no, tampoco hay una respuesta que yo pueda pensar que es incorrecta y graciosa, así que a ver. Infligir mis terribles modelos. Esta es como, como graciosa. There is no way I'm inflicting my terrible table manners on her on the first date. Oh, so you want to fake it and then show your bad sides when you get into a relationship. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't mean sí, it like that. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Ahí, mira, tomo, eh, él es típica respuesta incorrecta que me hace igual. Yeah. How's you, how are your table manners? I think they're fine. I think everyone should be fine. It's not something that I would admit to if they weren't fine. Pero una broma, todos se lo tomaron demasiado en serio. Okay, Sam, I'll pass the phone to Tanya. Hi, Sam. Stephanie said that you seem decent enough. Okay, I will meet you on Thursday, but if anything comes up, I will message you. Okay, great. El único que hablamos con ella directamente. If I have nothing good to do, I will meet him. Yeah, it was okay. Could have been a lot better, but it could have been a lot worse, so... Yeah, the thing is, on Tinder, she might have so many options. So even if she agrees for now, her plans could change if she meets someone cooler. Mm -hmm. You're done, bro, almost. ¿Qué desbloqueamos acá? That's the right move in this case, because, yeah, Te meto los be niveles, eh, okay. And you can put quality over quantity. Bueno, gente, yeah. eh, se desbloqueó el último, que es el sushi. Está desbloqueado, entonces lo dejaremos para el capítulo final de Super Seducer 2. Miren lo que dice ahí. Miren lo que dice ahí, se viene gente. Pero por ahora le vamos a dejar esta calle que el video salió extremadamente largo. Una hora, what the fuck, gente. Por lo general nunca... Creo que este es el capítulo que más duró de Super Seducer 2. Si les gustó el video, suscríbanse al canal, síganme en Twitter, síganme en Facebook, agréguenme a Instagram, compartan el video con todos sus amigos para que así seamos muchos más. Y compártanlo también para que todos nosotros aprendamos, ellos y nosotros aprendamos con el cochinote, con el degenerado a cómo ser unos galanes irresistibles para la policía y para la gente con la cual compartiremos celda en la cárcel por ser unos degenerados por seguir sus consejos que también nos vemos chao chao